confiding to Mary. And she conceived by the Holy Ghost. How may the progress of all this with thee, blessed are all among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother of God, pray, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it unto me according, me according to thy word. Hail Mary, for the grace of the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, pray, pray for our sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, for the grace of the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. <clears throat> All forth we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that as we have known the incarnation of thy Son, Jesus Christ, by the message of an angel, so by his cross and passion may we come to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Nomine Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti, Amen. Et voi voluntari Dei et Dei purificat Iubus Ultum Eum. Spiritum et Dei sedition et casum eum de gente non sancta, apen hoc in enum et quod lor sol nome. Quaetulus Deus, voti cum mea, quare et felicis quare tristis in cielo, dum et frigi veri meribus. Emite lugem tuum meritatum tuum, hipsum et delus celum tuum 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 et delus celum Copi te guti vincitora, Deus Deus Deus, quae tristis anima mea, al quale tu tuo basca. Sperem Deo, quale mea tocum i Deo ili, salutare vultus mea e Deus meus. Gloria, Patria, Filio, et Spedito, et Sancto, stico de lati in principio, e non crec sempre, et in secula seculorum. Amen. E in tuoi volatari Dei, ai Dei, in cui ti fica il Dio, e tutto mea un. Audi per mi nostro, mi nome di Domini, qui fece cielo del terra. Confiti in Dami Potenti, Dio ti Maria, te Dio ti Maria, ti Dio ti Dio, 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 Dio ti Confidio de uomini potenti, beati Maria sempre vigini, beati le cari arcangelo, beati le mani battiste, santi apostoli spettro e Paolo, omni santi e setti di frate, qui le gravini mi scoscia azione e bevo le opere, meo culpa, meo culpa, meo massima culpa. E io prego beata Maria sempre vigine, beati le cari arcangelo, Beata Giovanna Battista, Santos Apostolo Spettio et Paulum, Ale Sancto Sete Pate, Orale Pro Me, Adominum Deo Nostri. Miseriato Vesni, Gutens Deus, Mistificatis Vesvis, Gutunca Blasit Vita Metana. Amen. Fugenziam e Sussionam e Permissionam e Retornam Storum Tibio et Domes Domino Tens de Misericus Dormus. Amen. Deus te convenas es perfidica a vistas. E teps tu le metate ter in te. Pastet in nomis Domini, misericordia am Tua. Et salutare Tua in Tadavis. Domine, exaudi l'azione mea. Et clamo mea, sante bene. Et dominus obiscum. Et tu, Spirito Tuo. Ordemus. Sapientiam sanctorum narent populi et laudes et ordum nuncia di clesia, nomine autum et ordum vivent seculum seculi. Exultati justi domino regius decit calodatio, gloria patria et filio et spedito et santo, sicuderat in principio et nunc et sempre, et in secula seculorum ate. Sapientiam sanctorum narent populi et laudes et ordum nuncia di clesia, nomine autum et ordum vivent in seculum seculi. Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison, Christe eleison, Christe eleison, Christe eleison, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison. 
Praxa vobis et un spiritu tuo. Orden. Presta caesmus omnipotens deus, ut qui sanctorum acirum tuorum caos me damiat in natalitia calibus, a cuntis malis imminentibus, e orum in decessionibus libedemur. Per Dominum nostrum Iesum Christum, Filium Tuum, in te cum vivida regna di umanitati Spiritus Sancti Deus, per unia secula secula orum. Amen. Ordemus. A cuntis ad caesmus domini menti de copris de feti periculi, se te citente e beatre glorio se se begisne de genetice Maria, cum beatu di vos e fiatis apostis tuis petrus polus quae beatis put mani quel fini domibus sanctis, Salutem nobis trigo e beninus e pacem, utis russis e fisis atibus e tuoribus e nevesis, eclesi tuoi securi tibi servi e tibi pace. Eclesi e tuoi caesmus domine fregis procatus ad nite, utis russis e fisis atibus e tuoribus e nevesis, securi tibi servi e tibi pace. Er Dominum nostrum, Iesum Christum, Filium Tum, et ei cum vivida regna ad unanitatis Filipus Sancti Deus, per unia secula seculorum. Amen. Lex Livri Sapientia. Justi autime perpetuum vivet et apu Dominum est, mat merces orum, et cogitatio illorum apud altissimum. Ed eo cipia in regnum dei corris, et ea demma, sveci ed emanu Domini, quonium dextra sua tregi Deus, et gratius sanctus suo defende Dios. E cipia da maturam zelus ilius, et amabil prescretorum, et vulsionim nevicorum, induit procurace justitiam, et cipia et procale a iudicium cetum, sum escutum incumbabile e acquitate. Deo, grazie. Ab averem Deus e Dominus ex ativi Deus, et ex omnibus jubilationibus e iorum liberavi Deus, Deus res Dominus hispi jubilatus sunt corde, et humile spiritus salvavi. Alleluia, alleluia! Eges vere fraternitas, que vicit mundi crimina, Christum secutere est inclina, aut tenis regna celestia. Alleluia! Nomino suaviscum, et cum spirito tuo, sequenzio santi vangeli, secundum duca, gloria a te, Domini. In ino tempore descende in diesus de monte, sedit in loco campestri, et urbe discipulor meius, et multitudo copios et plebis a vomio dei, et ilus element maritima, et tiri et sidonis, qui venerant ura di Deu Deum, et sanerentur ad angoribus suis. Et qui vesa vontur, spiritibus in mundis corabantur, et omnis suo quereva te un trangere, que virtus de io e sei patet sanabat omnes. Et if se elevatis oculis in discipulus suos diceva, viatsi paupares, quia vestum es regum dei, viatsi qui non che suritis, quia secula bimini, viatsi qui non fregis, quia redebitis, viatsi eretis cum vos oderin comines, et cum speraverin vos et expropraverin, et dicet nomen vestum tanto malum, propte filium homini. Laudete in ina die et exultate, ecce eri merces vestra volta est in cielo. Nau sivi Christi. On this feast of Saints Cosmos and Damien, the lesson is taken from the Book of Wisdom. It is the just that will live forever. The Lord has their recompense waiting for them. The Most High God takes care of them. How glorious is that kingdom! How beautiful that crown which the Lord will bestow on them! His right hand is there to protect them, his holy arm to be their shield. Indignantly he will take up arms, mustering all the forces of creation for vengeance on his enemies. His own faithfulness is the breastplate he will put on, unswerving justice the helmet he wears, a white cause, his shield unfailing. And the Holy Gospel is a continuation of that according to St. Luke. At this time, Jesus came down from the mountainside and stood on a level place. A multitude of his disciples was there at a great gathering of the people from all Judea and Jerusalem and the seacoast of Tidea and Sidon. These had come there to listen to him and to be healed of their diseases. And those who were troubled by unclean spirits were also cured. 
so that all the multitude was eager to touch him, because power went out from him, and he healed them all. Then he lifted up his eyes towards his disciples and said, Blessed are you who are poor, the kingdom of God is yours. Blessed are you who are hungry now, you will have your fill. Blessed are you who weep now, you will laugh for joy. Blessed are you when men hate you and cast you off and revile you, when they reject your name as something evil for the Son of Man's sake. When that day comes, rejoice and exult over it, for behold, a rich reward awaits you in heaven. How many for grace the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. In nomine Christi, say, Filii, Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Carissimi, beloved in Christ, welcome to this broadcast mass as we set on this feast of Saints Cosmas and Damien, martyrs, uh, known in the East as Saints Cosmas and Damien, the unmercenaries and wonder workers, and special, of course, to us in the Latin West. Uh, for their names have be, been retained in the canon of the Mass uh, all these centuries since their martyrdom in around 285, the uh, early years of the reign and uh, uh, decree of persecution uh, of, Christ, of, of Diocletian. Uh, they believe to have perhaps uh, been born in Arabia, uh, twin brothers who were gifted uh, with the power of healing. Uh, they went to Syria, as he said, to uh, learn their craft, and indeed it is there uh, that they exercise their ministry. They are known as the unmercenary because uh, they refused payment for their services. This was something extremely unusual in those days for medical services. Nobody uh, got treated, uh, especially with, by, with medicine, etc., for nothing, but except those who went to Cosmos and Damien. Indeed, they went out seeking uh, the sick, uh, to apply their power of healing too. They are uh, legendarily attributed with having performed the first successful uh, transplant of a limb. Uh, you may find older, uh, sorry, you may find iconography of say the Middle Ages and the Renaissance uh, often depicting two, the two brothers as physicians uh, with a uh, Caucasian chap lying on a bed but with a black Ethiopian leg uh, having been successfully transplanted uh, to him. Perhaps that as a symbol of uh, uh, the uh, uh, generosity with the charity with which uh, the brothers applied their, uh, 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 their, their skills and their gifts, irrespective of race, creed, uh, or skin colour, etc. Uh, as I say, they were uh, arrested eventually, of course, for uh, refusing to renounce their faith in Christ. Uh, they are uh, said to have uh, suffered great torments and tortures uh, until eventually uh, they were executed uh, and became martyrs, early martyrs of that great persecution under the Ecclesian. So I said they have, uh, their names have retained to this day in the canon of the Mass. Uh, remember that that is the holiest uh, place, we might argue, of the uh, Divine Liturgy. Uh, their names there mentioned uh, after those of the early bishops of Rome uh, and of the Apostles uh, themselves, literally before uh, the consecration. Their uh, remains uh, may be found, uh, their relics rather, may be found in Rome uh, for uh, veneration. We, of course, my brothers and sisters, are likewise bid by the Gospel precepts to exercise such charity as indeed these brothers did. All other to say that we are to apply our gifts, our talents, our skills and abilities as they did to the service of God. And to the service of God means, of course, in charity toward both him and toward each other, indeed toward the stranger. Remember those questions that will be asked of us who have been baptised by Christ at the last judgment. Where were you when I was hungry, when I was thirsty, when I was naked, when I was a stranger, when I was imprisoned? Naked, hungry, thirsty, imprisoned, stranger, and 
sick. <laughs> yeah, and sick. Where were you when I was sick? These questions will be asked of us, particularly us Christians. And we, my brothers and sisters, must, have, must be ready with our answers. That is not to say that our salvation depends uh, upon it, but certainly our place in heaven, our Lord himself, though we know not quite what he means by it, says that there will be the greatest and the least in heaven. And for sure, my brothers and sisters, we should desire surely to be among the greatest in heaven. But in order to achieve that, we ourselves then must seek to serve Christ, to exercise charity then toward God in the service of others, and not to stint in our labour, not to do things half-heartedly. In other words, my brothers and sisters, particularly in the exercise of charity today in the church, in her various charitable apostolates, it is not enough just simply to give money if you are able to give time. If you are able to give time, if you are able to give uh, of your skills, uh, then these you should apply uh, primarily rather than money. Why? Because these acts of sacrifice ought to be acts of personal offering. Charity, remember, means sacrificial love. And to exercise charity means to love sacrificially. If you have the time, if you have the ability, if you have the necessary or useful skills, then you ought to apply them and use them first. Only if you are lacking in time or perhaps ability or skills, then you might throw money at something. And even then, when you give, you must give generously. You must feel the pinch, as it were, by your generosity. And you should, of course, do so cheerfully and not begrudgingly. Always, my brothers and sisters, the theme, the central theme of the Gospel concerning discipleship is about the love that we have for God. Yesterday we reflected on the desire of heaven. Yesterday we reflected on whether or not, or on where our treasure is. Where are our hearts? Are our hearts fixed, planted, rooted in heaven? Such that we, as it were, are desiring to reunite ourselves with our hearts and therefore are prepared to expend as much energy as necessary to do all that it requires to repossess our hearts. And likewise, for the exercise of charity, both toward God and toward each other, we must do so sacrificially. Remember when we began uh, Ash Wednesday, the season of Lent, the prophet Joel spoke to us or rather, God spoke to us through the prophet Joel, saying, It is your hearts that I want. What care I of your burnt animals, of your burnt incense, of your offerings? It is your hearts that I want. Turn to me with all your hearts. And remember the first commandment is, Love the Lord your God. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your mind, with all your strength. Christ himself says, if you love anybody else better or greater than me, than God, then you cannot be a disciple. We cannot emphasize enough, my brothers and sisters, what is required of us in order to achieve heaven, in order to receive eternal life. No half measures, no half heartedness. Remember the gospel from the other day. They are forgiven much, they are they love much who are forgiven much. We all of us, my brothers and sisters, are unworthy of the mercy and the absolution that we are given. For you and I know that despite, of course, the teaching of the church and despite our best intentions, 
though the absolution is given to us in the sacrament of hope, expressed by us, simply to love him, love him above all others. And as we've reflected before, when we love God, when we put God first, everything else falls into place. When we love God and put God first, we see with the eyes of faith and are able to endure. We are able to resist. We are able to remain steadfast. We are able to love more generously. And we are kinder, gentler, more humble people. We see this in the lives of the saints. We see this in the anecdotal histories of men and women throughout the ages who have strived to live in love and in union with God and with each other. We see how despite all sorts of trials and tribulations, despite all sorts of adversities, their trust and their faith in God was not confounded Isn't it incredible that we should still commemorate today the names and lives of these two brothers who died almost 2,000 years ago? These two who ministered even in, their, even in ancient times on the outskirts, as it were, on the extremities of the, of the empire. And we remember their names and we remember their lives, such as we have information left. Why? Because of the sacrifice of their lives and not just because of the manner and reason for which they died but also because of the way they lived life it's because they lived sacrificially for God and for others as well as the fact that they sacrificed themselves for the sake of Christ Wouldn't it be wonderful to think that in centuries hence our names perhaps might be remembered and that we might be remembered as they were remembered for our sacrificial living for God and for others. Let us, my brothers and sisters, take heed from their example. Let us discern what gifts and talents and abilities God has blessed us with. Let us discern how to best steward what we have been blessed to receive from God's divine providence materially. And let us strive to apply and to find ways to apply sacrificially all these things to manifest sacrificial love toward God and toward our neighbour. that irrespective of whether or not our names may be left to posterity at least we might pass to eternal life knowing that our lives sacrificially touched the lives of others positively and maybe even for their salvation. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen.
in Domino Suaviscum, Pecum Spirito Tuo. Ordemus. Ori abundur in te omnes, qui didi con nome tuum, quoni an tu Domine benedice es justo, Domine un scuto bone volen patis, tue coronasti nos. Secula seculorum. Amen. Dominus suaviscum, et in spirito tuo, sos in corda, alebus ad Domino, gracias ad Amus Domino del nostro. Dignum ad Iustum, et de veri dignum ad Iustum, et de come salutari nos evi semere tubico, et gracias ad Agile Domine Sante Pater, ogni tutel de terri deus, e Christum Domino nostrum. Ecco, ma è stato in tuo mando ad Angeli adorando a menazione, estremo e potestate, cioè di ciarrunque vetute e de beate serfim, 
So she thought that's the only contrary around the cook. It was a nice as well. She thought to meet you best every calm wood. So if she confessed to God, it changed best.
Domnia secula seculorum. Amen. Ardemus, precepti salutaribus maliti, de vires lucione pomati. Ardemus dice. Ad nostri quesi in cieli, sanguicei tu non tuum, veni ad re non tuum, fie volontas tua, sigo in cielo e in terra. Alle nostre un quotidiano de nobis fondie, dimite nobis, debita nostra, sigle nostri mitimus debitoribus nostris, et ne nos inducas in tentazione. Se libera nostra mano. Ermia secula seculorum. Amen. Exa Domini sit sempera vobiscum. Et cum spirito tuo. Agnus Dei, qui tolles peccato mundi in misere nobis. Agnus Dei, qui tolles peccato mundi in misere nobis. Agnus Dei, qui tolles peccato mundi. Don't know this part. Good evening, Anson. Love and announce and leave. Love and Ece agnus Dei, ece qui tolit peccato mundi. Domine non sum dignus ut indre sur tectum meo, sen pentum dic verbo et sen davitur anima mea. Domine non sum dignus ut indre sur tectum meo, sen pentum dic verbo et sen davitur anima mea. Domine non sum dignus ut indre sur tectum meo, Sent tantum dic verbo et sent davitur anima mea. Brothers and sisters watching Mass online and unable therefore to receive the Blessed Sacrament, we invite you now to make an, a spit, an act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that thou art present in the Blessed Sacrament. I love thee above all things and I desire thee in my soul. Since I cannot now receive thee sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. As though thou wert already there, I embrace thee and unite myself wholly to thee. Permit not that I should ever be separated from thee. Amen.
Dominus Vobiscum, et cum Spiritu Tuo. Orde, protega quaes musto avere proprio un Tuo me participatio celestis in ultra convivi e deprecatio colato sanctorum. Per Dominum nostrum e aesum Christum finium Tuum, per te cum vivi da regna ad unelitati spiritus sancti Deus, per Romia secula seculorum. Amen. Orde, Mundi ne mundi ad nos Christ mus nobre divini sacramenti munus oblatum. Et intercedente beate vision et degenetrice Maria, con beato Iosef beatis apostis tuis petrus, polot quae beatis cut mani tuis fili et omnibus sanctis. Acum dis nos vede de perversissibus ex beatos et de perversissibus ex petitos. Christ mus nobre Deus nostre, ut quos divine tribuis participazione gardere, humane son sinus a viaceri pericoli. Per Dominum nostrum Iesum Christum Filium Tum, qui te cum vive da regna ad unenitati Spiritus Sancti Deus, per Romnia secula seculorum. Amen. Dominus Vobiscum, et cum Spiritum Tuo, benedicamus Domino, Deo Gratias. Sit nomen Domine Benedictum, et sae monco tusque en sae curaudu tolu nostrum in nomine Domini, qui feci celum et eram, benedicat vos omnipotens Deus. Pate, et filius, et spiritus santus. Amen. Dominus Vobiscum, et cum spirito tu, anitium sancti Vangelii, sae contum Giovanne, Gloria a te, Vito Domine, in principio le bevum, e bevum, e le tabro devum, e Deus e le bevum, o che erat in principio a prudevum, omni prisum factus, omni simso factum, e snigum go factum est. In ipso vita erat, e vita erat, lux hominum, lux in tenebris, luce e le tenebre, non comprehenda erunt, cui tu mo misto se del cunevo le laci vanne, si veriti testum, oni mo testum, oni bevere du lumine, et omnes presum du illum, non è letto di luce, se lo testo mo li bevere du lumine, e le lux vera, qua illumina, tomne, mamine, brillanti, e me ne confondum, e mundo e l'atomus, mundo sum factus e sum unus sum non coniovi, e proprio e veniti sum nome ceperunt, quod quod autem ceperunt, e mdes vores tatum filos e fieri che scriprendi nomine eus, qui non è sanguinibus, nex volontati calis, nex volontati viris, e il Deo nati sunt, e il verbo, un carro factum est, e habitavit in nomes e vinimus gloria, e mens gloria, in quasi unigenetia pace, per un grazia e veritatis. Deo grazia. Now may the fruit of grace and glory is with thee, bless you, Lord, among the men, and bless you, this is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us, and 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 Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee we cry for banished children of Eve. To thee we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this veil of tears. Turn, O most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, who art our refuge and our strength, put down in mercy on thy people who cry to thee, and by the intercession of the glorious and blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, St. Joseph, her spouse, on thy blessed Apostles, Peter and Paul, and of all thy saints, in mercy and goodness hear our prayers for the conversion of sinners and for the liberty and exaltation of our Holy Mother, the Church. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Holy Michael, Archangel, defend us in the day of battle. 
Be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust down to hell Satan and all wicked spirits, who wander through the world for the ruin of souls. Amen. Most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy upon us. Most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy upon us. Most sacred heart of Jesus. Jesus. Jesus.